Number one is Gary. Oh boy, Anna Marshall of Washington Courthouse. Keith Haynes drives. Two is Happy as a Lark. Called and driven by Sam Coven. Number three, Phantom Like. Called by Tim Ryder for sales of Kentucky for Terry Groves. Four is Smoldering Ash. Called by Ron Barker of Chillicothe with Justin Hall. Number five, KW's Masterpiece. Called by Ken and Joanne Kirk of New Holland. Walt Ferguson Jr. drives. Six is Dance Craze, owned by Bill Lambeth of Columbus for Dave Majeski. Seven is Bill Bonder, Jim Florio of Hamilton, the owner Mike Wildera. Eight is Scratch, number nine, Cedar Lawn Mark. Oba Wesley Hilton of Huber Hots, Randy Tharps in the bye. Number ten, Squires Wrights, owned by Ralph Branson of Greenfield, Jerry Roberts in the Sulky. And there they go. And they're off. Smoldering Ash is first to leave from the outside. Dance Craze right there with them. And from between horses, KW's Masterpiece came away third. Far outside fourth, Cedar Lawn Mark. From between horses five comes Bill Donder. Inside a sixth happy as a lark. Early seventh, Gary. Racing early eighth, Phantom Like. The uh, trailer ninth is Squires Wrights as they approach the first quarter mile marker. Dance Craze sets the early pace. Part of the outside, Cedar Lawn Mark is looking for the front end as they reach the first quarter, 28 and 4 fifths. Cedar Lawn Mark is part of the outside of the pocket, racing a third, Smoldering Ash. Racing a fourth, Kid of his Masterpiece, gapping slightly five, Bill Donder. He now comes to the outside to get into the passing lane. Racing a sixth comes, happy as a lark. To the outside, seventh, that's Gary, saving ground eighth along the rail, Phantom Light. To the outside, ninth comes Squires Wrights as they approach the half. And Cedar Lawn Mark Park throughout puts a nose in front as they reach the half in 58 and 2. Off the turn, they circle down the back stretch, and it's now Cedar Lawn Mark by a length. Dance Craze on the inside is racing a second. Here comes Bill Donder with a live cover, but he'll lose that live cover as they straighten out down the back stretch. And Bill Donder marching right to the front end. And Cedar Lawn Mark is now tiring after the long trip. Here comes Happy as a Lark with live cover. And Squires Wrights was last at the half. He's now moving quickly on the outside. And racing a fourth on the inside is Cedar Lawn Mark. Gary is fifth at the three quarters, 128 and three fifths. Midway to the final turn on the front, Bill Donder has him by two and a half. Happy as a Lark is racing a second. Squires right of the outside is pacing a third. Gary into striking position fourth with less than an eighth of a mile to go, but it's all Bill Donder as he continues to lead by three lengths. Squires right to the outside. Cedar Lawn Mark coming back alive in deep stretch now. Bill Donder. Squires right says rushing. He'll be too little, too late. It's Bill Donder at the wire. It won 59 and four. Race one is now official. Seven ten perfecta, three hundred sixty-eight dollars eighty cents, three sixty-eight eighty. Uh, the trifecta seven ten two paying one thousand one hundred sixteen dollars sixty cents, eleven sixteen sixty. Track side, the official winner of the first number seven, Bill Donder, seven-year-old son of four, the record from double take by winning worthy. Oh, then trained by Jim Florio of Hamilton, Ohio, Mike Wilder in the Sonke. Second season's victory for Bill Donder, pacing tonight's mile 159 for fifths. First race trophy presentation by the Rainbow Lane.